I'm still exhausted. Uh, I was walking around Costco for, you know, two and a half hours yesterday, spending absolutely all my money on mattress toppers and really big bags of corn chips and, you know, whatever. I'm jealous, man. You know and two goes, hours right? spent at Costco sounds like heaven to me. At I, least they yeah. feed you. <laughs> they, at least they do feed you. Yeah. For I, 99 cents. Yeah, the, yes. the 99 cent hot dogs. You know, it's the, And they haven't raised the prices. And the leaders, the, the founder of Costco was in a board meeting once when I think the, the new CEO was trying to uh, he suggested increasing the price on the hot dogs, and the founder's statement in the meeting on the record was, I'll kill you <laughs> if you touch the price on those hot dogs. It's going to be 99 cents. We lose money on it. We know. We don't care. Um, he literally threatened violence? He said, I'll kill you. You can look it up. It's, but, it, you know, it, it, that would, uh, we can support that sort of sentiment, I think, because yeah. he was doing it to help people eat on the cheap and uh, looking out for the working man, right? And Costco actually was in the news this past week because they were they had an earnings call and they were talking about the inflationary impact and you know how much more it costs for them to buy all their goods. And a an analyst from UBS, an investment bank, said, "Isn't this the time to raise your membership fees?" And the CFO of Costco said, "Nice try. We're eating at least two to three percent of the inflationary cost before we pass any product cost increase on to the customers, and we're not touching this." He said something along the lines of, "We need to be a beacon of uh, during this time when people are having so much trouble affording things. We need to help them rather than just see it as an opportunity to to jack up prices." And I took a look, and uh, uh, Costco's stock is up like nine percent on the year. So, as it turns out. Um, you know, making sure your customers can afford to shop at your store is good business, good for the bottom line. So, um, you God know, bless shout Costco. out to Costco. Yeah. So let that be a lesson, everyone else. Right on. Hi, I'm Ed Maher. You just watched a clip from the Workers Mic. You can find our shows anytime on YouTube or tune in at 8 a.m. on Sunday mornings on 720 WGN.